Westmore did in pardoning 175,000 people who were previously convicted of marijuana is amazing and everyone should be doing the same. I'm Eliza Orleans, career public defender here in Manhattan for the last almost 15 years. And in case you haven't heard the news, Governor Westmore of the state of Maryland pardoned 175,000 people who had previously been convicted of marijuana possession. And this is after possession of recreational marijuana was legalized back in 2022. Westmore has commented about how seriously he takes this, and especially it being Juneteenth this week, which commemorates the end of slavery in the United States. Um, he says this is about equity, it is about racial justice. This is a triumphant victory for African Americans and other Marylanders of color who were disproportionately arrested, convicted, and sentenced for actions yesterday that are lawful today. Because marijuana, as I said, legalized the use of recreational marijuana by constitutional amendment, which was approved by voters in 2022 and decriminalized possession in small amounts for personal use. And other states have done the same and other governors should be doing what Westmore is doing. This is truly commendable. This begins to address the racial disparities in our criminal legal system. It certainly doesn't fix everything, but it's a start and hopefully we'll see more from other governors as well. Feel free to leave questions in the comments and like and follow for more. Thanks.